few months after her debut in WWE in 1999, Stephanie McMahon had a romance angle with the late Tess. The two even got engaged on screen and planned their wedding before the billion-dollar princess suffered an unfortunate accident. At Rebellion, the British Bulldog stormed into Vince McMahon's room to confront the former chairman and his son, Shane, about not getting a WWE Championship shot in his home country of England. As he angrily threw a metal garbage can, it hit Stephanie McMahon, who was speaking on the phone at the other end of the room. Following the accident, the billion-dollar princess suffered from amnesia and struggled to remember Test for the next few weeks, leading to the wedding getting postponed. Nevertheless, Stephanie ended up getting her memory back. She proposed to the former Intercontinental Champion inside the ring after the latter squared off against Val Venus on the November 1, 1999 episode of Monday Night Raw. After months of being together on screen, Stephanie McMahon and Test were scheduled to marry in a wedding ceremony on the November 29, 1999 episode of Monday Night Raw. However, Triple H, the then rival of the billion dollar princess's father, Vince McMahon, interrupted the wedding to reveal that Stephanie had already become his wife. He played a video of a drugged Stephanie sitting next to him in a car as they married in a drive through ceremony in Las Vegas. Although the billion dollar princess initially demanded that Triple H sign an annulment, she later betrayed her father and sided with the game to establish the McMahon-Helmsley era in WWE. Stephanie McMahon is synonymous with WWE. As the daughter of Vince McMahon, the architect of modern professional wrestling, she has played many roles in the company, both on screen and off. She's been a fierce villain, a powerful executive, and a devoted wife and mother. Her real-life marriage to WWE legend Triple H, Paul Levesque, has been one of wrestling's great love stories, both in the ring and behind the scenes. But what if we told you there was a time when Stephanie McMahon proposed to a former WWE champion, and no, it wasn't to Triple H. That story, surprisingly little known to most WWE fans, happened during a pivotal time in Stephanie's life, both personally and professionally. In this narrative, Stephanie found herself connected to someone who was not only a major name in WW, but who also shared a deep bond with her that led to a shocking proposal. This is the tale of a moment when the queen of WW let her guard down and showed the world a side of her that was rarely seen. Before we get to the proposal, let's rewind to the time when Stephanie McMahon was still finding her footing in WWE. The world had yet to see her full transformation into the authoritative powerhouse she would become, but behind the scenes, she was deeply involved in the company's creative direction. Wrestling was in her blood, and being part of WWE was as natural to her as breathing. But like any young woman in her 20s, she was navigating the complexities of relationships, both personal and professional. Though Stephanie would later go on to marry Triple H and form one of the most iconic power couples in wrestling, there was a time when her heart belonged to someone else, a man who held one of WWE's most prestigious championships. To truly appreciate the gravity of Stephanie's proposal, we must first understand who the other man was. A former WWE champion who had charisma, in-ring prowess, and a larger-than-life persona. This individual was respected not only for his achievements in the ring, but also for his magnetic personality outside of it. Though their relationship was kept under wraps, Stephanie and this man were drawn together by their mutual passion for WWE and the unrelenting pressures that came with it. In a world filled with over-the-top characters and scripted drama, their connection was one of the rare moments of authenticity. Stephanie who had grown up in the intense environment of WWE, found comfort in the former champion's grounded nature. They shared long conversations about the business, late nights brainstorming storylines, and a bond that went beyond the squared circle. The chemistry between them was undeniable, and while their relationship remained behind the scenes, there were whispers within the wrestling community. 
Both of them knew they were living in a high-stakes world, where any misstep could end up on the front page of wrestling news sites or fuel endless gossip. The proposal itself came at a time when both Stephanie and the former champion were grappling with their future both in WWE and in life. Wrestling is a business that takes everything out of you, physically and emotionally. The pressures of constantly being in the spotlight, living on the road, and maintaining a top position in the company weighed heavily on both of them. But through it all, they leaned on each other. One fateful evening, after a particularly grueling week of live shows, the two found themselves alone in a quiet hotel room, far away from the chaos of WWE's corporate world. They had been discussing life dreams, ambitions, and the toll wrestling had taken on them. It was a raw, unfiltered conversation, something that rarely happened in their high-pressure careers. They talked about their fears and what the future might hold for them both. It was in this moment of vulnerability that Stephanie, who had always been known for her strength and resilience, found herself overwhelmed by her emotions. For years, she had been the one people looked to for direction, the one who made decisions for the company and carried the weight of the McMahon legacy on her shoulders. But in that room, she wasn't Stephanie McMahon, the billionaire wrestling executive. She was just Stephanie, a woman in love. I have never loved anybody more than I love you, Stephanie confessed, her voice filled with sincerity and emotion. The words hung in the air, heavy with meaning. She had been caught off guard by the depth of her feelings, but now that they were out in the open, there was no turning back. And then, in a move that shocked even her, Stephanie asked a question that would change both of their lives forever. Will you marry me? The proposal stunned the former WWE champion. This was Stephanie McMahon, the woman who had grown up in the royal family of wrestling, asking him to be her partner for life. For a moment, it seemed as though time had stopped. The champion, who had always been cool and collected, found himself speechless. He knew that accepting Stephanie's proposal would change everything not just for them, but for the entire WWE universe. Their relationship would be thrust into the spotlight, and the scrutiny would be relentless. But there was more to it than just public perception. The champion, while deeply caring for Stephanie, wasn't sure if he was ready to settle down or if he could handle the complexities of being married to someone with such a powerful legacy. He admired her strength, her intelligence, and her heart, but he knew that being with Stephanie meant embracing a life filled with constant pressure and expectation. After what seemed like an eternity, the champion gently declined the proposal. He told Stephanie that while he loved her, he wasn't sure if marriage was the right step for them at that moment. He wanted her to be sure, to take time to think about what it would mean for both of their futures. Stephanie was heartbroken. It wasn't the rejection that stung the most, it was the realization that sometimes love, no matter how strong, isn't enough to overcome the challenges of life. She respected the champion's decision, but it didn't make the pain any easier to bear. In the weeks that followed, their relationship slowly dissolved. They remained close, bonded by their shared history and deep respect for each other, but the romantic connection that once burned so brightly began to fade. Stephanie threw herself into her work, using WWE as a distraction from her personal heartache. She was determined to prove that she could succeed, with or without the champion by her side.